we have a problem statement here let's read it and understand it very clearly before writing the c program so let's read the problem statement given three variables x y and z write a function to circularly shift their values to right that means we need to shift the value of x to y and y value to z and z value to x circularly move the values to right so let's continue reading in other words if x is 5 y is 8 and z is 10 after circular shift y is 5 z is 8 and x is 10 that's what we told you so let's further read it call the function with variables a b c to circularly shift the values so it's very clear let me show it to you once again observe the values of variables x y and z here so if x is 5 y is 8 and z is 10 we point it with the pointer variables a b c so we need to shift the value from x to y y to z and z to x after circular shifting y value will be 5 z value will be 8 and x value will be of course 10 so let's write the program with this understanding i'll take three integer variables x y and z and i'll ask the user to enter three numbers and store it inside the address of integer variables x y and z so address of operator is ampersand ampersand x ampersand y and ampersand z means address of x address of y and address of z okay now let me print out the values of x y and z before circularly shifting their values to right so before shifting right x is equal to percentage d percentage d is the is the format specifier for integers y is equal to percentage d and z is equal to percentage d so values present inside variables x y and z now let me call a function user defined function which we need to define it i'll just call it shift underscore right observe here i'll be passing the addresses of x y and z here that is ampersand x comma ampersand y and ampersand z so after that let me print out the values of x y and z okay after shifting right that's it for main method i think coding for main is finished now let me define the function shift right our function doesn't return anything so its return type is void i'll take three local pointer variables that is star a which points to value of x star b which points to value of y and star c which points to the value of z okay i'll take a local variable temp for swapping the values it will help us so observe the values of a b c here i'll take temp and pass the value of c to it that is temp is equal to 10 now let me copy the value present inside star b to c, star c and the value of star a to star b and the value present inside temp to star a observe the values here pause the video and observe the values of a b c okay that's it i'll give 5 8 and 10 now so before shifting right x is 5 y is 8 and z is 10 now after shifting y is 5 z is 8 and x is 10 so circularly shifting the values to right so let me write the prototype for this i'll remove the variable names that's how i prefer it just make sure our compiler knows that these are pointer variables i'll simply cut this function definition and paste after the main method okay so this is function call this is function prototype and this is our function definition so save it compile the program and run it once again so i'll give 10 20 and 30. so x is 10 y is 20 z is 30 now y is 10 z is 20 and x is 30. so clearly it's shifting the values circularly to the right let me give two three one after circularly shifting it should print one two three three and one one two three yeah it's working great so this is how we circularly shift the values of variables in circular fashion okay so 
please visit the link present in the description section of this YouTube video for source code notes and discussion about this topic. Stay subscribed to our YouTube channel and blog and please share this video with your friends using your WhatsApp, Telegram, WeChat or any of those chatting applications and also on LinkedIn, Twitter, Facebook etc. And please do not forget to like this video on YouTube. Thank you.